Obama came invited by the government which evolution pushed it out to no no and I'm, I'm very sensitive toward the American uh, policy because I saw in our modern time America never touch any country and make it good maybe Germany maybe but the other examples is very bad in Vietnam in Iraq in uh, Afghanistan in Somalia in everywhere they are looking for the according to their uh, way of thinking how we can play how we can take more and more and who will collaborate with us who is ready that's it without this European thinking based on a lot of studies and uh, orientalism and uh, in America president and ambassadors are working in very simple way and usually it makes damage so I don't think that uh, Obama's visit uh, was very uh, important it's just a show Democracy is a dream and you can say by one night and one day you will find it. It's a very long way to the, look to Europe. How many time European spent to, to, to catch democracy? Centuries, not years. Now the situation is better. Some countries. Egypt, because we have, we were lucky. We have intellectuals inside the, life, the society. We, during the revolution, we think about what happened and make this dialogue with each other. So when we faced the uh, Islamic Brotherhood uh, group. We can push them out after one year. But Libya, Syria, has not this privilege because the uh, presidents like Gaddafi and Bashar, they push all the intellectuals outside the border. So when the revolution happened there, society was without any thinker, in intellectual, in dialogue, in internal dialogue. And because of that, we hear daily about these miseries in, in Libya and Syria and so on. A few months ago, I said in uh, in Egypt, in a TV interview, that our the, the Arab uh, twin brackets leaders used this problem to keep themselves rulers and another. This, uh, this uh, critical situation of women in society started with Judaism, in fact, for historical and religious reasons. And then it moved to Christianity and Islam. This is the historical and roots of the problem. But right now, it's easier in Egypt and Arab countries to push women out. 
it's not correct because our society needs this power in the uh, Tunisian and Egyptian revolution you can see women everywhere doing what they have to do for their countries then the Islamic people came and pushed them out now I'm writing and, and talking about the next time if LCC the officers come he should he must look carefully for this this society consists of man and woman and any social action happen without this participation of women it will be false and take us again to, to the past I hope we learn these lessons from history and from the present time too and look to the woman in respect because respect woman is respect the human being a part of the ancient belief about the goddess and the beginning of uh, human civilization from uh, goddess and women as a representations of uh, goddess no a part of this it's true but now we live in a society without women it will be blind and ignorant and savage we have a lot of uh, pops we have a coptic one and orthodox greek orthodox one and one in vatican i hope all of them to be to have the peaceful discourse that christianity started with you know what's the first speech of jesus christ love love is a key for many problems we suffer from this. so i i hope that he and the others and bishops also yani put their eye on this word love